Hey mate, good afternoon. Welcome to your virtual tour on the Jeep Rubicon that you've been quiet on. Now this virtual tour, I'll be going through all the interior and exterior of this car. Pointing out any scuff marks or any marks that needs to be noted at first point of sale. Now as you can see, it is quite raining here in Cairns. I am in the service department here on the cover, just to give you a work around tour of the vehicle. Now to start the vehicle off, flares, brand new tires on the front, genuine factory bar there as well on the front there too. Obviously your signature Jeep grill, nice big headlights there as well. As you can see the clear coat on the vehicle is still in immaculate condition. I have to shammy the vehicle, so my apologies is a little bit streaky, uh, just to get that rain off for you. But as you can see, there's no dings or dent. Very clean, very neat and tidy. Windscreen there as well, there's no chips or pack or anything at all whatsoever. Zoom out from this angle here. Work your way down. Obviously, if, if signature flares, now these tyres, if I do recall, are your, one second, the size is here. There we go. 285 70s. You've also got the aftermarket alloys there as well. And brand new rubbers, as I mentioned. Very clean, very neat and tidy. Okay. Work your way down. Nice little trail radar there as well, badge. Nice big black mirrors there as well. The side steps, same as the door handles are all blacked out. So just giving you a full 360 view of the exterior. I will then make my way inside the interior of the vehicle very, very shortly. Back tire, same thing with the alloys, brand new tires. You can see very clean, very neat and tidy. Okay, slowly making my way back to the rear of the vehicle. Very, very stylish looking Jeep. tailgate nice big brake lights recovery points you got the rear sensors in the back there as well we've got the flat seven spare tire underneath there as well okay and then open it up you've also got two spares in the back there as well just in that photo for you you've also got the tub line i fitted to the car okay Close that up. Oh. Zoom out from this angle here. Work your way around. As you can see, very clean and tidy. Close to me in new condition. Without obviously having to wait. It's all ready to go. So just slowly making our way back to the front of the car just to give you a full 360 view. Okay. Make my way inside the vehicle now, starting with the back seats. All right. Nice bit of leather, red stitching all the way through doors. Little side pockets there as well. Leather interior all the way through. You've got ISOFIX fitting there as well on the seats if you do need them. Okay. Genuine floor mats there as well. Carpet all the way through. The cup holders and your windows are here as well for the windows to push it up and down. Okay. Air vents there as well too for the rear. Now this roof on the front looks like it's got a clip release so you might have to take the roof off there as well. I'll show you on that side there. But as you can see, very clean and tidy. Plenty, plenty of leg, race, leg room 
and space. Also here we've got the 0921 is the uh, compliance plate on the vehicle. Driver side door now. Door handle, central locking and your mirrors. Leather on the front there as well. Nice bit of Rubicon stitching on the front there too. And a pretty, pretty nice looking interior with the nice red splash back there on the, on the dash. Genuine floor mats. Again, my apology for the dirt. I was in here driving the vehicle. Headlights there as well. Adjustable dimmers there as well for you too. Jumping straight in. Now before us to go through the accessories of the vehicle, just want to show you is that rip sustain, that nice red stitching all the way through as well on the dash, nice big touch screen there as well. Okay. Windscreen, no chips, no crack at all whatsoever. Now over here, two set of keys. Now you still got the switchblade there as well for the for the key for the actual doors itself. But it is a push start ignition, two set of keys. Start button's just there, which I'll show you very shortly. Over here, you've got all your owner's manual, your service history booklet. You know, you've got your radio connection there as well for the manual. Um, look, services, the car hasn't been done. It's not even due for a service just yet. It's only got 6,000 Ks on the clock, as you know. Only due for 12,000 there. Now to start the vehicle, put your foot in the brake. Starts just here. Close the door. Just turn it down a little bit. 6,000 Ks on the clock. Feels a bit low, but that way it can get rectified for you. No dramas there at all. Very nice setup there. You've also got the digital speedo there as well. Okay. Your revs are on this side. There's no one last as well. Handbrake and my seatbelt. All right. Obviously your Jeep badge and the horn and airbags. You got the Bluetooth settings here as well. You got the cruise control there as well too. Very, very easy to use. You can go through different settings here on the actual speedo of the vehicle. All right, you can go miles or kilometers. It's all in there for you. Very, very easy to use. And you've also got here as well. It tells you if you're in an incline or decline on left and right or front or back as well. Cool it. Kilometers and miles. Put it back to kilometers there for you. Okay. Now, Blinkers are on this side and your wipers are on this side, obviously, very, very easy to use. As I mentioned, you do have your lights just there. Now over here, you do have a touchscreen display, sat nav, and you've also got the reverse camera. As you can see, the camera on these is amazing. Very, very clear. Okay. And there's all touchscreen here as well, climate control, all that in there, very, very easy to use. Settings, sat nav, like so. Over here, temperature say fan speed and your temperature for left and right for your uh, temperature for dual okay as you can see 17 on that side 21 and hotter on this side all right volume radio stations all in there as well multimedia settings AUX USB and you've also got the another USB point there as well for your charger cigarette lighter there as well central uh, power windows are all in there for you as well up and down very easy to use now over here, front and rear for your diffs there as well. Off-road and sway bars are all in there, settings in there. Very, very easy to use. Automatic transmission, okay. Neutral, reverse and drive with your triptonic settings there as well. Full drive, high gear and low gear. Again, all very easy to use. Just follow the gauge to go up and down. Handbrake with a nice bit of red stitching. Same goes for the gear stick there as well two cup holders and you've got a pretty pretty massive center console with the nice bit of stitching as well there too very deep okay just a little bit of dirt there very deep also there as well for the middle so there's your interior All right, back to the front now. So there you have your virtual tour on the Jeep Rubicon Dual Cab. I hope you enjoy and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you.